Good afternoon. We are in bracket play of the CRC qualifier here at the Hall of America in Kansas City. It is really windy today. I apologize in advance for this video. It's going to be pretty low quality for the sound, but hopefully visible it will be very good. Clemson against Iowa Central in the quarterfinals. Shallow kick by Clemson to start off this match. Take it by Honey Potato very well. Offload quickly to Elliott Finn. Trions are looking to start quick here. Jabari Leopold breaking one tackle. Eventually getting dragged into contact or into touch. We're gonna have our first line of the day very quickly. This with the wind we have out here today, the lineouts are going to be very difficult as well as the passing in the back line. We'll see how the boys can manage through on both teams. First line out goes deep to Clemson. Thrown in by Clemson. Well tracked by the Tritons and a good tackle leads to a knock on. And the knock on went into touch. We're gonna have a line out here. A front toss to Elliott from Richard. Richard gets that back and tosses it out to Matthew Barker who loops around the outside of Jabari Leopold. Diving over penalty against Clemson. It's going to be a penalty awarded to the Tritons. Matthew Barker's down. But he's certainly not out. He looks like he got his head knocked on that one. Right into the dirt by the tackle. Line out to the Tritons. Lineouts will be a struggle point for both teams today. That one was stolen by Clemson. Kick downfield by Clemson into Iowa Central Territory. It was scooped up by Clemson. They're going to draw first blood here. That one goes shallow, or wide left, I apologize. It's gonna be five to zero. Clemson has the lead. A good kick by Clemson, and they take the kickoff. Two trying players were there, but they couldn't quite get in between there. Mike Wilden tracking his man. He's going to have to get out here to the outside. He gets there. He gets a little assistance from Elliot Finn, it looks like. They're going to hold him up. Held up. He's held up for quite a while here. Sir's not calling anything. Oh, 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 
eventually drug out of bounds. I'm not sure how long the Tritons had to hold it up there. Now they got that ball in quick. Out to Sofian Benmefta with a nice long pass across half the field there. Not rolling away by Clemson is another penalty awarded to Iowa Central. A tap and go by Richard Felton. He gets it out to Ani Matedo. Sofian Ben Mefta in there with a nice rock. That ball gets out to Matthew Barker, back to Elliot Finn. He's going to put one stiff arm on, run into some more contact. He's going to break another tackle. Good hard running there. Scrum advantage to the Trions, penalty advantage to the Trions. I apologize. Another tap and go by Richard Fellon. He's going to go to the far side of the field now. Elliot Finn with a good run. Ani Mateo getting this one out to Jabari Leopold. He's going to make one step, try to find a gap here. That ball was stolen by Clemson in the ruck. Advantage to the Tritons after that forward pass. Mike Wilden scoops it up. He's going to run for a bit. Not releasing the tackler. Another penalty against Clemson here. Richard Felton taps and goes. Gets it off to Elliot Finn, who drops it backwards, so play on. On Matedo, Sofian Ben Mefta. A good ruck by Ani Matedo there. Good strong hold waiting for his teammates to get in place. The wind took that one back a little ways. I gets out to Mike Wilden, who is Gonna score a try. We got 5-5 five, five all here in the first. Wind is intense out here. That kick has missed. It is 5-5 all at the halftime here. Iowa Central against Clemson in the quarterfinals of the Heart America. It is a blistery day out here. I am wrapped up in a couple t-shirts, a jacket, a scarf, a hat, gloves, and a blanket, and I'm not sure how they're out there on that field right now. It is intense. Ugh. Uh, for those tuning in that might not be familiar, the game was sevens. Uh, it's played with two seven-minute halves. The first half just completed, and then there is a one-minute halftime, and then a never seven-minute seven half to follow. And that's what we're about to kick off here shortly. There is one substitution at the half. Uh, looked like Elliot Finn, Baz went off and Shundo Williams comes on for him. Richard Felton with the kickoff. A nice high deep kick. Iron Potato on the chase, got sidestepped there, but Shundo Williams was there to help out. Penalty against the Clem or against uh, Tritons. Clemson taps and goes. That ball was definitely forward. It was forward, but he didn't see that. But he saw the high tackle. A 
Another penalty on Shundell Williams for that time for tackling right away off of Mark. Another tackle by Shundell Williams. Clemson sending out wide. A booming smack by Ani Mateo, but he got the ball off. They get another 10 meters out. A nice hit right away off the rock. Penalty awarded to Iowa Central there. Great tackle. Richard Fellon off to Ani Mateo. A big hit by the Clemson player. A knock on by the Tritons. It's going to be a scrum down to Clemson. Clemson setting on a substitute here. Front row sub, they just exchanged their tight head prop out. Clemson wins that scrum. Sofian Ben Mefta contesting in the ruck. Good tackle on the outside. That looked like Mike Wilde and Ani Mateo. Clemson has numbers on the outside. It's Iowa Central needs to shift. They got the shift on. It's going to be a penalty advantage for a high tackle there. Jamari Leopold making another tackle. Tried to run it up the gut. Unsuccessful. Clemson has a penalty here. They're going to tap and go. Get it to the inside. Richard Felton just got ran through. He still tracked his man. Clemson's going to score a try, though. Clemson ahead 10 to 5 in this second half. Nathan Epple coming on to substitute. Not sure who he's on for. Conversion successful, 12 to five. Clemson has a lead by seven points here in the second half. Vanya Sturm also on this match, coming in as a substitute. Boise gets something going here early. Right away off this kick. 12 to five is the score right now. Another substitute for Clemson coming on. And the kickoff goes. Bounces and goes out of bounds. It's gonna be a line out to Iowa Central. That is Mark, so we are going to have the line out. Felton with the throw, Sturm with the take. Nathan Epp with the mullet. Gets tackled by a Clemson player. Richard Felton boots it downfield. Scooped up by Ani Mateo. Got it out to Vanya Sturm, who's going to step a couple times. Gets tackled. Uh, the Sir calls a penalty against uh, Iowa Central there. Clemson tackler still on there, but that's fine. Sir telling the Clemson players to stop wasting time. They get a kick on, gets out to Shundell Williams. He's going to step a few times and eventually get down. Offsides call. Iowa Central has a penalty advantage here. Horse collar tackle. Richard Felton gets this one out to, tries to get out to Jabari Leopold. No advantage gain. It's going to be a 
penalty awarded to Iowa Central on the far side of the field. Nathan Applett taps and goes. Gets it to Sofian Ben Mefthu. He's going to run hard into contact. Gets tackled. Ina Matato and Jabari Leopold out here on the outside. A nice offload to Jabari Leopold. He's going to get in for a try. And the Tritons will need this conversion. It's 10 to 12 right now, pending conversion attempt. A beautiful play by Ani Matato to hit that gap hard. Conversion successful. We got a 12-12 game here deep into the second half. What a game. It's cold, it's blistery. Players may not want to be on the field necessarily right now, but everybody watching this has to be a, has to be stoked. Another substitute on for Clemson. A nice high kick in this win by Richard Felton. The line out is established. We are going to have a toss in by Clemson. Thinking about going quick, thought different. Lots of blue in the backfield. Front man throw by Clemson, smart thinking, but they're going to call not straight. Line out to the Tritons. Well, the sir is conferring with his AR. And it is going to be a scrum down to Iowa Central. Great choice in this weather. Well won by Iowa Central. Gets that ball out to Nathan Eplett, who's going to dummy, find a gap. Good clear out by the Tritons. That ball gets out to Ani Matato. Ball gets tossed around a little bit, eventually settled. Barry Leopold looking for something, gets it back to uh, Richard Felton, who gets out to Ani Matato, who tries to get it to Sofian Ben Mefta. Looks like a scrum advantage to Clemson. That's going to be full time here. We're going to go into extra time. Sounds like golden goal, if I'm not mistaken. What that means is first team to score wins. Shake it off, baby. We got more time to play. It ain't over. Let's go, Sophie. Shake it off. Come on. End of the second half. We're going to have a little rest period. This is a big matchup. This is the quarterfinals of the CRC Heart of America qualifier. What that means is the winner of this tournament goes on to the big dance. Those of you wondering, Iowa Central is part of the INSCRO. <coughs> INSCRO uh, conference, division. Um, league, Inscar League, I apologize, Inscar League. They are a few steps below as far as uh, where they're essentially set up for their conference play and whatnot. A few steps below almost every single team here. And uh, 
we already qualified for nationals for Inscro and came down here to Kansas City this weekend just to run with a few more big names and a chance to qualify for the big, big dance. And uh, the boys have showed up and they have played with some heart. Started a little slow yesterday against USC, ended up getting the win, uh, shutting USC out in the second half, scoring a couple tries, then completely dominated New England College. Uh, I believe it was 45 to zero. Made it to the quarterfinals, in here playing against Clemson University. And the winner of this will take on the winner of AIC and USC. Another coin flip to determine who gets the kick, who gets to receive, which way people are going. Iowa Central is going to be kicking off, but they will have the wind at their backs. A deep kick. Iowa Central is there quickly. Held up by Vanya Sturm, eventually got down. A mishandle in the backfield for Clemson. Clemson got it out wide to their wing there. Jabari Leopold met him quickly. Clemson running down the sideline, dragged down from behind by Shundell Williams. A bullet pass and it's gonna be a knock on, awarded to Iowa Central. Clemson sideline is furious here. They're screaming for high tackle calls. And there's a player down on the far side for Clemson University. The last thing anybody wants to see is some injuries. Hopefully he comes out off the field just fine. Get him up, get him moving. The trainer has got him up, has got him moving. He's breathing. It looks like he got the wind knocked out of him with the tackle. He's staying on the pitch. We're going to have a scrum down to the Tritons. Nope, he is not staying on the pitch. He's going to be substituted off for a guy named Tank. And he looks like he could probably hit. That is a pretty big boy for the game of sevens. But he's got some fresh legs. Let's see what the Tritons could do off this scrum. Richard Felon's gonna go weak. He's got Jabari Leopold. He's got a one on two on one. Jabari Leopold's got a burst and he's gonna get a. He's gonna put the try down. Tritons win. Tritons win a golden goal. Iowa Central with the victory. They're moving on to the semifinals here in the Heart of America tournament. Great heads up play by Richard Felton and Jabari Leopold to the weak side here. A very, very hard fought match by Clemson University. They definitely gave Iowa Central the test of time. But the Tritons do come out victorious. We're on to the semifinals. What a match, what a match. 17 to 12 is the final score here.